Mr. Weisberg, how do you think it went? Alan Weisselberg was on the witness stand for three days. Uh, he finished up his testimony Friday afternoon. Alan Weisselberg is the longtime chief financial officer at the Trump Organization, which is former President Donald Trump's uh, real estate empire's company. Um, Alan Weisselberg has testified for the last three days at the company's criminal tax fraud trial. He was billed as the prosecution's star witness, and he gave some insight into how his tax fraud scheme, essentially dodging income taxes on personal expenses that were paid for by the company, how that also benefited the company. He says that the company was able to save money by not paying uh, Medicare taxes, for example, on some of the money that it would have otherwise had to pay him uh, in order to have him be able to pay those expenses out of his own pocket. Uh, he did not declare those expenses as income on his personal income taxes and has pleaded guilty to 15 counts and is due to begin at some point a five-month jail sentence. Now, his plea agreement required him to testify as a prosecution witness, but he also uh, was helpful to the defense at times, saying that, for example, Donald Trump and members of the Trump family did not know and were not involved in his scheme uh, to save, to dodge money, uh, to dodge taxes, I should say, uh, on those on those perks that he received. Um, he did testify on Friday that Eric and Donald Trump Jr. did become aware of what he was doing after the fact when the company audited its financial practices in the wake of Donald Trump's election to the White House. Um, after that, he says he was not punished by the company. He was actually given a raise, which prosecutors say suggests that at the very least, uh, the company was condoning or looking the other way once it learned about these practices.